of course, looking for ways to improve their science. And we have one of those Im improvements to tell you about this afternoon for your health. This involves a popular form of cosmetic surgery. In the past, lip enlargement was just temporary, not so good. Now, however, there's a new way to do it, and our Dr. Bruce Hensel is here. He's got this exclusive for you. Bruce? That's right, Kelly. Now, this procedure actually won a special award for plastic surgery. It uses the patient's own tissue. For some people, that can provide all sorts of benefits. Big, beautiful lips. Many movie stars have them. Like many people, Mary Chase wanted them. You see it in all the magazines and everything. It's just more fun to have big lips. Now Chase didn't want fat injections or collagen. She's heard those don't last. And foreign substances may cause allergies. So Chase went to Dr. Randall Hayworth, who says he's one of the pioneers of a new lip technique using the patient's own tissue. What we do is take... Uh, strips of tissue taken from inside the mouth and we redirect them inside the lips. Chase's procedure took just one and a half hours. The incisions and stitches are inside the lips. She was back to her normal life that week. Playing volleyball, I was out, you know, just doing what I do, working, I went back to work. It's permanent, it's using your own tissue, therefore it's supple, soft, and feels very natural. With no allergic reactions. Now here's a before and after picture of one patient and another pre-surgery then a few weeks later and this is what chase looked like before okay, she I'm says people are always her telling her she looks better than person. ever they don't even realize she had her lips done i'm really happy i think they look great they do the procedure only costs $2,500 to $4,000. It's not covered by insurance. Now, some doctors love the technique. Others prefer other procedures. It's a personal choice. But you have a right to whatever option you want. Check them all out and never hesitate to get a second opinion. Chuck, Kelly, back to you.